Today we find out which is better, new Photon Hypernova or new OTS-21. What's up guys, we're back with another versus video and we have 24 packs of OTS-21 versus a booster box of Photon Hypernova. We've had pretty great luck with both these sets so far, but today I wanna to find out which is better. Now I'm recording this in pre-release, so I don't know exactly how the prices are gonna turn out. Uh, I think we're gonna have it out the day of release, so the prices are probably gonna be a little different because we're editing it before pre-release and all that stuff, or during pre-release. So it's gonna be a little different, but let's see which can win based on the prices that we have right now. Our giveaway for this video will be two structure decks, the Sacred Beast and Sock of the blue eyes white dragon for all you yugi boomers out there just like me like the video be subscribed turn on notifications let me know what you think will win photon hypernova or ots 21 now we have a ton of potential amazing pulls in here ots obviously has the ultimate rares photon hypernova has some crazy secrets and you know starlight rares of course which we probably won't pull but we'll have to see rescue ace hq there's just a lot of good potential in here we're gonna have to see what we can actually get I do have, like, we finally actually have updated sort of prices on OTS-21. We'll see if it actually matters. A couple of bases. We've got the uh, Minaruka. We've got the Vala, Ice Jade Manifestation, Dynamondo, the Gravity Ninja, Ice uh, Script. We've got the Diabolantis and the Homunculus, I like to call it. It's not actually what it's called, though. I hope you guys saw yesterday's case video because, uh, yeah, we went a little crazy. It was awesome. Do not miss that video. It was some great pulls of Photon Hypernova. Double trap hole of spikes. Pretty weird, but we've already seen some weird stuff out of OTS 21. I mixed them up, but it doesn't seem to matter. Double rescue ace. Okay. Uh, one, two, three, four. Let's see if we can get a nice starlight. Here we go. Cash here, Big Bang. Galaxy Summoner. We got Casa Molar. Super Producer. XE's Align. Giant Ball Game. Shell of Chaos. And Fairy Ant at the Circular Sorcerer. Okay, we're starting off a little weak. That's okay. A lot of packs to go, guys. Nothing to worry about. We can get something big. We just got to get something on... So most sides probably don't have a lot of points right now. We've got the Havness. So this is already at one. So, uh, you know, got hit by the ban list. Awesome. Ban list kind of crushed that guy. So, you know, the tier limits in general are kind of hurting a little bit in terms of value, I'm guessing. A couple of aces. Awesome card. Infinite. We got the Fierce Tiger. The Bastralis. The Yagaramaru. We got the Chaos Beast. Light of the Branded. Scareclaw Cash Tira. And Dogmatica Matrix Super Rare. Starting off hot with approximately zero pulls. Let's see if we can change that right here. A booster box worth of OTS. Will they be able to win? Number 29 Mannequin Cat. It's a different card, so we cannot get mad. Not the same Super Rare like last time, which is good. That's a plus. Now... Can we get a starlight again? Circle of the fairies. We got tier elements or tier limits. Okay, gigantic thunder cross, Yagarimaru, Emperor Summonite, Cash Tier Rise Heart. Okay, ultra rare, nice pull, very solid. First money pull for Photon Hypernova. That's good. Ultra rare, we'll take that. Let's see what we can get out of OTS 21. Can they respond? See, Scareclaw Cash Tier. See, like this is a common in this set and a super in this set. It's really weird. It's very weird. I don't understand how that works. I think. Let me let me compare them when we pull it again, just to make sure that they're not like similar cards, and I'm just thinking they're the same. Uh, yeah, it's pretty weird. We got Castle Molar, Ice Jay Manifestation, Galaxy Summoner, Mental Tuner, Gishki Grimness, Brandon Befallen, the Monocroid, the Diabolantis, and the Pressure Planet Raidsaw. That is the second best secret rare in the set. Oh my goodness. Whoa, okay, huge hit. Huge hit alert for Photon Hypernova. This is our set. I don't know why, but for some reason, this is our set. Another massive card. Wow. Okay, OTS, you're going to need like an ultimate rare. Even the ultimate rares, I think only Finrear gets above that card. So you literally have to pull the best card to beat that now. Scareclaw Cash Tira, another one of those. Oh my gosh, what a box so far. Two Cash Tira cards. Our Photon Hypernova random box luck from locals has been insane. Mental Tuner, Gishki. Chaos Phantasm, we got the Galaxy 100, Intimidating Ore, Gigantic Thundercross, Photon Emperor, Pharaonic Advent, Super Rare, OTS 21, what can you do to recover and win this battle? It's going to need something big, Tabari the Sky Ninja, that is not going to cut it. OTS 21, that is not going to cut it. One, two, three, four, let's go. We have Focused Aquamir. The Mini Aruka, the Defanging, the Big Bang, the Monocroid, Land Flipping, Branded Befallen. See, Scareclaw Cast here. Look at this. 
So there's a, it's a common in this set and then it's already got a super reprint. How does that even happen? These sets came out at like the same time. It's really weird. I don't know what's going on there. And then Dogmatica Alba, pretty strange. I'm not sure how that works to be honest. OTS, you are gonna need a Fenrir. Bless us with an ulti Fenrir, Abyss Actor, Light of the Branded. That is not an ulti Fenrir at all. I can't believe we pulled the Wraith Soth or whatever it's called. That is insane. I don't know how to say that. Wraith Soth? Tier Laments, Perglia, Defanging, Time Stop, Overlap, Super Producer, the Ball Drake. We've got the Align and the Ultimate Great Insect. Still a lot of packs to go. 48 total packs open in this video. So quite a few packs. A lot of potential to pull some good stuff. Testudo, Errat, the Galaxy Expedition, Rescue Ace HQ for, you know, what's like the third time already. But that one card really made Photon Hypernova just kind of go crazy here. Let's see, can we make it happen? Can we pull a Starlight now? Just really put it away. Bio Insect, Liberty, Fierce Tiger, Light of the Branded, Abyss Script, Gishki Grimness, the Cash Tier Overlap, and the Queen Butterfly, the Naeus. Okay, the Butterflies are at it again. Now can we get the Fenrirs at it again? Sacred Sword of the Seven Stars, cool to see that again. Amazed Attraction and number 29, Mannequin Cat. So pulling basically the same Super S. I tried to shuffle them a lot, but it didn't seem to really work that well. One, two, three, four. Bio Insect Armor, pretty cool. Abyss Actor, the Fierce Tiger, Monghu, the Tally Ho, the Diabolantus, with the Core of Chaos, Meteor Rush, Terminating Ore, Plunder Patrol Ship, Jord. Ultimate Rare, come on, we need one. We need a big one. We have Mysterious Puppeteer. And the X Pearly Happiness. Okay, another super rare. Photon, what do we got? One secret, one ultra so far, both great cards. So we're looking pretty solid in terms of value on that side. Anything else is just going to be pu putting the cherry on top for that box. Pretty good. Numeron Creation, Evil Eyes Unleashed, Giant Ball Game, Yagamaru, Ice Shade. Ooh, okay, that's a bad one. So, okay, finally got a not a great card in that box. Now OTS. This is your chance, man. Galaxy Expedition and Tier Elements Merly, which would have been good, but, you know, Tier Limits. I Tier Limits. I keep saying Tier Elements. I can't help it. It's a habit. Yeah, that's that's not great now after the ban list. One, two, three, four. Photon Hypernova. P-H-H-Y. Let's go. Sour scheduling, chaos stuff. You love to see that Yaga Mamaru. We got the dramatic story, land flipping, gold pride, nitro head. Still a lot of packs to go. Still a lot of chances for OTS. It's not over yet. We cannot give up. Ultimate rare could turn it around. Rescue Ace HQ. Honestly, I would have thought the OTS had a better chance because like you usually get an ulti, you know, one every, you know, 16, 17 packs versus this where it's like really hard to get a really good card out of a, a core set. You know, it takes a couple boxes usually. Uh, doesn't seem like that's the case. Gishki Grimness and uh, Evigishki Neramanius or Neramanus or something. I don't know. <laughs> that's a very difficult name. There's some crazy names in Yu-Gi-Oh. That's just a thing. That's just a thing Yu-Gi-Oh has. We got Mud Dragon of the Swamp and a number 29 Mannequin Cat. More repeats. Who would have thought? It's an OTS 21. Who would have thought? One, two, three, four. Can we get something big? Cash to a big bang. They're certainly having a big bang in this battle. We got the Focus Aqua Mirror. Got the Photon Emperor, the gigantic Thunder Cross, Core of Chaos, Shell of Chaos, and there's a Secret Rare Way Bridge. I don't think that one's eh, kind of iffy. So that's opening the door for OTS 21. Just got to believe that you can pull something big, that this can happen, that it will be amazing. It will be epic. Network Trap Hole, Photon Sanctuary, Black Feather Counter. Okay, that's, <laughs> that's not it. I mean, that's the card that we started off pulling like a million of those the other day. One, two, three, four. Gishki Necromir, Casa Molar, the Ice Jade Manifestation, the Basil Trice, the Branded Befallen, Meteor Rush, Monocroid, Diabolantis, Core of Chaos, Dimensional Allotrope, Varus. Wow. Okay. 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 It's definitely a you know a cold street. We got a big seeker rare. Nothing since Tier Elements Merly. Tier Elements Merly. I said that right the first time. One, two, three, four. Starlight Rare. Now, that would be pretty crazy. Now, that would be awesome. Focus Aquamere, Springins, Kaime, Core of Chaos, Gigantic Thundercross, Yegamamaru, Photon Emperor, and Chaos Witch. More Chaos stuff. Love to see that. I like the Chaos stuff. I think it's cool. What do you guys think? You guys think that OTS can come back? I don't know. Time, Space, Trap Hole, and <laughs> Black Feather Counter. That is just like a, a freaking token. You're like, oh, awesome rare we got there. I mean, the tokens are cool, but like getting multiple of them, it's like, okay, maybe not. All right, Ice Jade Manifestation. Ice Jade, you love to see it. Vassal Trice, Mental Tuner, Gishki Necromir, Gigantic Thundercross, Xyz Align, Dynamondo, Chaos Beast, and a big Welcome Labyrinth. I think that's going to be a decent card. That's not terrible. Not too, too bad. What are we down to? Like six-ish packs each? Something like that. Galaxy Expedition, we need an ulti here. Like big time. 
Scareclaw Cash Tira. That's not an ulti at all. Okay. No, this is seven left here. So we probably have, yeah, seven here and six of the other, the OTS. Manticore Smashing. I think it's a really cool artwork, cool card in general. Chaos Phantasm, Gishki Necromirror, Bio Insect Armor from Weeble Wonderwood. Summonite. We got the Monocroid. Land Flipping. Branded Befallen. Of this actor's dress rehearsal. Okay, just another super. OTS 21. Let's go. We have Trap Hole of Spikes, Sacred Sword of the Seven Stars, Tier Elements Merly, Tier Elements Merly. I said it wrong yet again. All right, one, two, three, four. Don't worry. Starlight Rare will make up for that mispronunciation. Chaos Phantom, the Sorry, got Perlegia, the Defanging <laughs> Chaos. How did I just say that? Creation, Ball Game, Diabolantis, and Sneaky C. He's sneaky and he's a C. Where's the ulti? OTS 21. Did I shuffle? Did I do you dirty with the shuffle? Time space trap hole. I did you dirty with the shuffle so far. We don't have any ulties. It's rough. It's a rough opening, but don't worry. Photon Hypernova. There's still a chance. One, two, three, four that you could blow it is what I'm saying. Or there's a chance you could put it away with the starlight right here. Scareclaw Defanging. Photon Time Shop. Scareclaw Cash Tira. Light of the Branded. Abyss Script Dramatic Story. Gishki Grimness. And the Abyss Dragon Sword Song. Four packs left of each. So yeah, a few, not many. Ultimate rare is needed here to win this. And that's not it. That's a Tabari the Sky Ninja. Photon Hypernova has a huge lead right now. Like a massive lead. One, two, three, four. I think. I mean, I could be wrong. These supers could be worth like 12 bucks. And in like pre-order status, they could actually be. Vala, we got Bistial Baldrock. We got the Shell of Chaos, Photon Emperor, the Gravity Ninja. Gold Pride, start your engines! Three packs left. OTS, you need the Fenrir to bring him back. We've got Abyss Actor, we've got a Maze Attraction, and Tabari again. Okay, not, not good to see the doubles here. Photon Hypernova, you have three packs, only two for OTS 21, so it is very grim. One, two, three, four, but theoretically there could be two ultis in there. Circle of the Fairies, Cast your Big Bang, Vala, Abyss Actor, Liberty, Dramaticist? Okay, Land Flipping, Numeron Creation, uh, Evil Eyes Unleashed, the Giant Ball Game, and the number 12. Number 12 is added again. Two packs of each. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to open Foats on Hypernova first because they're they're ahead. And we're going to see if OTS can come back. One, two, three, four. Talio Spring. I mean, I think they're ahead. Circle of Fairies. I don't see how they could actually be behind right now with like a huge card. Chaos Beast, Dynamondo, Ball Drake. And a Chaos Archfiend. They're just adding on to the lead. That's an ultra rare. We have gotten two secrets, so it's probably Starlight or Bust at this point. Maybe an another ultra. I'm not sure. I haven't kept up. Focus Aquamere, a couple of aces. The Ruka, Vala, Gravity Ninja, Unleashed, Numeron Creation, Grimness, and another super rare. So that means it's coming down to these final two packs right here. We basically need like back-to-back -back ultis to have a chance. Maybe one, maybe a Fenrir could bring them back. We'll have to see. Fenrir could be huge. Let's see if it'll happen. Ultimate rare. Let's go. Mischief of the Gnomes. And a Sprite Red. I'm probably a decent card, but I think Sprites got murdered by the ban list. And our final chance. We need that Cash Tira Fenrir ult. Ultimate rare friend rare. He's like a friend, but you know, okay, come on. This has to be an ulti for a chance for OTS. Let me know in the comments. Do they have a chance? Will this be the ulti? Let's go network trap hole. Come on the versus battle. It ends here. Mud dragon of the swamp. It's photon hypernova, the champion of this battle. We have to see I'm struggling. We have Sprite red back to back. And that is 24 OTS duds. And that means photon hypernova is your versus champion. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic content like this. Shout out to Tone Fo Show, Daxer, JT Cho, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, Dizzy, Flexi Boy, Hoppus, Choice 333, Micycle, James Jance, TCG Trust of Cards, America Deutscher, Supreme Sage 21, Frankie Martinez, Nana Tai Show, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Mimic Gecko, Shadowfall, and Thomas McLean. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.